Of a way to start a match from Jay Hagberg. The end of the table. Oh, what a get and what a fit winner. How was he able to get his paddle on the ball after that rip down? Hagberg to serve, game two. Boom. Great step. Both these players love to be in their backhand corner. Hagberg, after every single point, he just looks ready for the next one. Tyrese on the international field. Wow. Strong serving from the forehand side, but then stepping around the backhand, and again, finding that wide, moving that backhand corner. Style, how, how would you characterize maybe after this point? The Sweden style. On Hagberg's paddle. And Hagberg wins it 11 9. Not a ton of emotion for Jay Hagberg throughout the match. And Seattle steals a point in doubles. The Phenom Adi Serene coming up with singles next for Seattle. Oh, what? game three. Oh, oh. How about that shot from Jay? Make square contact. <laughs> or you can just use your back hand. Go needs to keep the attack going. Pack oh. oh. him up. Huge backhand from Hagberg. Sets it up so nicely, gets the first forehand and is completely committed getting his forehand in. Non-down table tennis for putting the ball on the table is often enough, but he has to take advantage, put more pressure. And he shakes it off. Serve off the backhand side there. Brilliant combo. He uh, to finally get over to the forehand side. And then just so fluid. Nice. And two serves, nine all. And pops it down. That's his body motion between the points. And you can see the celebration. Twists his head away from that with a smile. What can you do? And we saw shots like that in the first and second matches. Also, our commentary counterpart, Evan Leffler, who's been delightfully sucked. ACC, Wake Forest in Virginia. This one missed by about a foot. Just a weird jump. Watching online. I'm sure they are. Probably recovering from yesterday's. Just One off. Great fade and power. When you get a player who can change the direction and curve the ball like. <laughs> the curve on that ball Three, to get four. the rally finished for Hagberg. I mean, this is bomb central. Just look at the heavy spin. Lily doing everything she can to stay up to the table. And then Hagberg. Big serve and attack from Johan Hagberg. Serves 
off the back of the paddle on the serve. Just making a big imprint there. And Hagberg with the heavy spin, loading it up so much. No offensive shot would be slightly weak receive against his serve. He's going to get him with the forehand. And that's nice turnaround. Yeah. Hagler loves to come in and go for the winner. And just, again, super technique, putting everything. Reminding Johan not to. Oh, that's a nice end below the table. Going up, they tend to, that one was much cleaner there. Yeah. And twice now, Hag. I think beforehands, but his backhand is really powerful as well. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's that's, on, you can't on, prepare for yeah, that. Yeah, and it's 15 in the golden game. <laughs> the most important point when it was 2020 against Dan Liu. Hagberg wants it some time to get into position. And Ojo sends the ball long. Johan in a position where he needs to win both, really. Ojo goes for it. It's Hagberg who takes 2-1 in games. A bit of a surprise here, I thought, going into this match, but Hagberg just really played all the big points at the end of each game. That much sharper and kept Ojo. I can tell you one thing, Sean. He's going to be pretty thrilled with the opportunity to put the headset on right now because he's a man who loves an interview, and as he said the first time, loves the limelight. Managed to perform. Oh, look at that. The Wong Jinshin seems to have some issue placement and control when he goes into that keep it on the table. He's such a colorful player no more. 11, 9, <laughs> game finish. Now living. at play here now on where he might hit the next ball. Yeah. And Hagberg gets 11, 11. the job done. What a great... Finally, the last ball misses the back edge. And Hagberg places himself in a situation where if the spinners can win the golden game, we'll definitely have him back for action. Yes, I think he deserved it. Um, Here for Yasi. Oh, what a counter. I can punch, can block. But a beautiful sweeping forehand here from below the table, Jay Hogberg. Take a look first. And the second one, the way he guides that ball. Oh, down the line, seatbelt shot here. Crossed the chest from Jay Hogberg. This serve gave Lily Jong a lot of trouble. Jay Hogberg was the only how used to wear this. Wang Chu Chin as well. Oh, patiently waiting there around the backhand corner. He turns quickly. Watch him move. That ball is so. There's the power. Jeremy Hazina opens, but too fast and too wide. And Jay Hogberg. Love the extension. Gets the rack out that direction. Takes a lot of work to win a point against Jeremy Hazin. He gets so many balls back in play. He can block forever, it seems. The Jay Hogberg dance after that shot. It'll be fun to... And then this weekend, I've seen him at least once. Oh, he may be on this table, yeah. On this table. In singles, I don't know. Oh, ripping shot down the forehand. Give us something quick. We've got to do it for a game. Opening topspin right into that... That's a huge point. Shaken, not stirred. Walking the walk. 
right now. Nice sort of feel for the meal. Oh, that's toast. Wow. Just to toasted down the line. Just melting the butter. The bench for a winner. Oh my goodness. Just sweeping this one. Closed racket. Oh man, the in. But they've definitely shown some uh, some big changes in the team. This oh, this one's too pretty. This is what we've been waiting for. He's played some highlight shots to the ground, inside out forehand, loses the knee brace. Him. 